Let's balance the equation for Rb2O plus H2O, cerebidium oxide, and then we have water. This is considered to be a combination or a synthesis reaction. If you're asked the type of reaction, you have these two things here coming together to form one new thing. So combination or synthesis is the type of reaction. To balance it, let's count the atoms up. Two rubidium, we have one oxygen, but don't forget this one oxygen right here. So we have two oxygen atoms on the reactant side, and we have these two hydrogen atoms. Product side, one rubidium, one oxygen, and one hydrogen. It looks like we just need to double all of these numbers here. One goes to two, one oxygen goes to two, one to two. So if we could just double all of these, we'd be done. To do that, we'll put a coefficient of two in front of the rubidium hydroxide. One times two, that'll give us two. This two, it goes to everything here. So one times two, we have two oxygen atoms. And one times two, we have two hydrogen atoms. And this equation is balanced. If you were asked the states, we'd have solid rubidium oxide, water would be a liquid, and then if we had excess water, this would be dissolved in water, it would be aqueous, it's a strong base. If we had just the right stoichiometric ratios here, we would end up with a solid. This is Dr. B with the balanced equation for Rb2O plus H2O. The type of reaction, combination or synthesis. Thanks for watching.